Hello, everybody. We're continuing to talk today about the, uh, the right attitude to work. And, uh, you know, this, uh, we have talked about some principles, but today I want to make it very practical. What do you think you like to do most? What do you really like to do most of the time? Do you like to just go and work somewhere? Or most of the time just go work, work, work? Or you like to actually play around, like, uh, you know, talk to some people on phone and, you know, spend time talking to friends and, uh, um, you know, discussions and uh, watching TV, uh, internet and things like that? Well, if you are like me and if you are like everybody else, yeah, everybody wants to play more than they want to work. Most people want to play that when they want to work because that's the demand of our flesh. Our flesh demands for us to work. Our flesh, I'm sorry, to, to play. Our flesh demands vanity to spend time, you know, uh, satisfying yourself, your desires, your flesh, your, 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 to look for leisure. leisure. Well, but that is exactly the thing that we are not supposed to do because those are the things that don't lead to success in life. And that's a major difference between successful people and failures. Successful people are people that feel like doing those things, but they deny themselves the privilege of going to work, whining time away on television, or talking on phone. They deny themselves those things, and they force themselves to go and do what they don't want to do, what they don't like to do like going to work, like going to read, or like going to write, or like going to look for uh, something to do. Because people who just do what they want to do all the time, going to you know, sp talk on phone, spend time on the internet, and just waste their time away, they are people who become nothing in life. They are the failures of, our gener of any generation. But those who, who, who hold themselves in their hands and who, who, who cut short their, their selfish desires and go to do labor, work, when they don't feel like working, they are the ones who become great in life. If you really want to have any chance to be great, you must curtail your desires to, for pleasure, and you must work when you don't feel like it. And that's a major principle in becoming somebody in this life.